prosecutor's fallacy is the belief that because the probability of each individual event is low, then the probability of any event at all must also be low. So I always thought this could be called like the statistician's fallacy, but unfortunately for me, I'm not the one who gets to name these things. The first one, Thrasymachus says, There are 100,000 fish in this lake, and the chances of catching me each one are low. Therefore, the chance of, of me catching a fish at all must also be low. Edamantus points out that you may have a low probability of catching each individual fish, so if there's some kids looking for a very specific fish, then that chance is low. But, Adamantus continues, if you add up those low probabilities, you actually get a high probability of catching some fish. So, Adamantus thinks that Thrasymachus isn't going to catch just one, but probably like four or five. So, in the second example, Thrasymachus says that Zeno caught the biggest fish out of 20 of us. The chances of that are so low, he must have cheated. Adamantus points out that the chances of Zeno catching the biggest fish may have been low, but someone had to catch the biggest fish. So, and this assumes that everyone, or at least one person, caught a fish, so there is a small chance that someone didn't catch a fish at all, so no one would have caught the biggest. But chances are, someone's going to catch the biggest fish, so it has to be one of those 20 people, might as well be Zeno. And in our final example, Thrasymachus says, I don't know how I found out that, how I found that village when I was lost. The chances of it must have been one in a thousand. And Mantis points out that the chances of Thrasymachus finding that specific village are low, but the chances of him finding some village somewhere were actually pretty high, because if he keeps walking, he's eventually going to run into some kind of village or civilization somewhere.